Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'll show you side-by-side -side comparison of Logitech G403 Wireless versus Razer Viper Mini. This is just an information video about the specs of these products and if you want to know the actual prices check links in the description down below. The Razer, Vi Razer Viper Mini is an amazing gaming mouse that is slightly better than G403 Wireless. The Razer is wired only and it's quite a bit uh, smaller and lighter. It has ambidextrous design and that's uh, well suited for any hand sizes using fingertip grip. It also has a remarkably low click latency. On the other hand, the Logitech is a very good option if you prefer something wireless. If somewhat bigger and quite, uh, it's somewhat bigger and quite a bit heavier, but it has a wider CPI range and a bit less CPI variations and a lower lift off distance. So if we take a look, as you can see, the main uh, thing that we have to talk about is how uh, important for you is to have a wireless mouse or the cabled mouse. For FPS, well, or FPS games, uh, the Viper Mini uh, should win all the time. Even though it has a cable, it's very, very nice, very fast, uh, very fast mouse. But uh, you can enjoy uh, MMOs with wireless mouse or mice is more, in my opinion, even with a bulkier one. For ultra light gaming, obviously, you want to go with uh, Viper Mini because it has only 61 grams, which is a uh, featherweight and 117 grams with uh, G403. So in the travel, uh, the travel mode and travel mood, you can enjoy obviously wireless mouse better. And Viper Mini, you know, since it has a cable, it's not that uh, compact. Let's look from above. As you can see, it's a really small, uh, the Viper Mini, it's a really small mouse. Uh, with palm grip, it fits only the small hands and it's getting better with uh, fingertip grip, for example. Doesn't need batteries, it's really a uh, really small, fast mouse. But it uh, is maxing only at uh, 8500 CPI, even though uh, G403 is maxing at 12K, adjusting steps it's uh, every 50 at G403 and every 100 and every 100 CPI at Viper Mini. Both of them having uh, six uh, buttons, combination of optical and mechanical at Viper Mini and pure mechanical at G403. Both of them got only notched wheel uh, without a free wheel. And, uh, and software-wise, Logitech is using obviously G-Hub, making it uh, fully compatible with Mac OS, and Viper Mini is using Synapse, making it only partially compatible with Mac OS. It's really hard to decide which one I would pick, because I really like Naga products and I don't really care about the cable. So, but also I, I'm enjoying MMOs better, so I can see my uh, hand having a better rest on a bigger mouse, which G403 is. But for FPS, I would literally really go with Viper Mini. So share your opinion in comments. What's your thoughts on these two products? Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.